39 this Sunday morning as a new school is on the horizon. Decades of alum came to one Fraser area school to walk those halls one last time. I caught up with Fraser High School alum who shared all their memories before the school is demolished. From the class of 1954. This is a great turnout. I, I was the second graduating class. I am so proud of these people that have come here because this was one of the best schools in Shelby County. To 1996. Just a lot of memories. When you step in the building, it all comes back. Uh, I was looking for our trophies we had back in 95. We went to the state tournament. It's all those memories coming back. Feels good. And all those decades in between. We are roughly one month from the 50th anniversary of our graduation. And this was the first time I've been in here since. I, I tell you what, I could button this jacket the last time I was in here. <laughs> I, I could still button mine. <laughs> <laughs> Hundreds showed up to the old Fraser High School to walk the halls one more time. The school, which has operated as MLK College Prep since 2014, is being demolished soon. So the principal invited alum to get a look and feel at their old stomping grounds. Great time. I wouldn't have trade going to school here for nothing. Teresa Ryan Rovery, Lysandra Cleves, and Debbie Cuffey all cheered for the school in the 80s. Teresa's father even coached there for 40 years. It's amazing. I mean, it's, it's heart-wrenching and amazing and wonderful, and I didn't just spend high school here. I, I've been here since 70. That's when I was born, you know, on a blanket out there at football practice. So I had 36 years here. So it's this is home. And while some recount the good old days. The best memories we had was senior night, where we would actually spend the night. Actually, we would stay the night all night and decorate, and the halls and the, each grade would compete against each other. And of course, the seniors always won. And it'd be the cheerleaders, the football players. Um, it, it's like Teresa said, it, it was home, and we were a family. Others say, They'll miss it. Uh, it's sad to be losing it. This it was a staple of the neighborhood. We just, it was home for us. Alum shared this advice to future students. And when you hit senioritis, you think, I want to go, I want to go, I want to go. But relish in this time, cherish this time. Um, know that these people, they're your family 30 years mm -hmm, later. Yeah. 